Friday. Hope you're all right. I can't believe it's Friday. As if it's Friday. Can you hear my dogs? It's so hot today. It's like 27 degrees. 27 degrees. We're not going out today. So the past few days we've been up the beach doing a bit of swimming. I say swimming, the kids have been swimming. I've just been standing there going, <laughs> brilliant. <laughs> you're doing amazing. You know, I wish I could swim, but I just can't. I know I've said this before, right, but I just don't know if, like, you're never too late to do anything, yeah, I stand by that, but I just don't know if a swimming instructor, sh a stri swimming instructor, <laughs> okay, swimming instructor, I don't know if um, they would, you know, work with me because I just cannot take my foot off the bottom, right, and I've seen the adverts, which they float, all right, they're very serious, like float if you're in trouble, but I literally cannot float and nobody understands. I just sink, all right, I don't float. I've tried, I've laid on my back, I've done everything. I do not float, all right, so I don't know what's going on with that. But I just don't, so, <laughs> do you know what I mean? It's Honestly, I, I can't do it. And I look at my kids swimming and I'm like, <sighs> do you know what I mean? Like, I'm so proud, like, because I never swam as a kid. I just stood at the side of the pool watching everyone else swim. But Tyler and Mason have had lessons, so yeah, it's really nice. But um, yeah, I'm waffling on, ain't I? All right, but um, yeah, we've been at the beach the past few days. So Steve's took his deck chair, kids have been swimming, and it's just been really hot. So today I've decided we're not going to go out. I'm going to catch up on a few bits, you know, around the house. I've got a few emails and bits and bobs to do and just tie up a few loose ends. So yeah, we're not going to go out, but it is scorching to be honest and I'm about out of sun cream I need to get some more I did try and get some in home bargains the other day I'm literally telling you my life story there's just no need is there anyway hope you're all all right you've had a nice day I have got a really itchy back I'm surprised I can itch it hang on but um yeah hope you're all right I'm doing a clothing try on today so this is the moment Faye realizes there's only so much you can stretch the shit out of something before it is done for and you know I'm my own hype girl. So in the charity shop, I'm like, yes, Faye, that'll fit you. All right. <sighs> and then I'm gonna try it on nine times out of 10. Maybe they fit. And then, you know, the other, you know, it, it doesn't. And, you know, this is the realization in the try on that, you know, it might not fit. So that's what we're doing today. If you wanna stick around, I'm gonna do a bit of a clothing try on. Absolutely sweating my tits off, so I thought of a try on. <laughs> and this, this is me, um, me winter jumper. Somebody said, listen, two things, all right. So this is yesterday's video. I will link it below if you want to have a look at the actual haul and what I got and stuff. But someone said, Henry Holland is an English designer. And this is proper like top quality, so I will to find that everything was a pound. And then this one, right, somebody pointed out that this is a really expensive clothing brand. And I tried to find this exact dress, but I can't. But every other dress is like £100 plus on the website. So this is the, the Maasai Clothing Company. And this was that big dress with the pockets. I couldn't believe it. I literally... I couldn't believe it. So what I am going to do though, is I'm going to go in all the expensive ones. And I'm going to take you with me. Next time I go, I'm going to go in all the expensive ones and show you. I'll show you Sue Ryder as well. We'll, you know, do a bit of a come to the trousers with me. But um, yeah, I'll show you Sue Ryder and then we'll walk to the rest and I'll show you the others and we'll go for coffee and that. I'm literally talking like you're here with me. I wish. We'll go for coffee. I'll show you this little hidden gem in this place and that place. But um, I wish. But um yeah so that's what i'm gonna do today a clothing try on i love this you know this is my little sleepy head well you've seen it you? but i'll link the video below if you've not but um yeah i'm gonna do a clothing try on i'm also um because i'm not like, posting more on instagram um which is just going off at the minute i am doing a giveaway so i'm trying to get to seven thousand followers so i'm gonna do a bit of a giveaway i think i'm about 104 off maybe not sure, I'm not so I'm not quite sure I'm not quite sure oh my god honestly I speak like this all the time I can't get my words out or I really mix them up all the time even you know like if you're having a serious conversation I was with um Steve's family the other day and I did it like I just middle me work muddle me words up 
But um, yeah, I'm doing a giveaway. So as soon as I hit um, 7,000 followers, I'm just going to do like little giveaways for like every every little bit, you know. So yeah, if you do want to follow me on there, it's VJ202. Yeah, I'm posting like a little bit more on there. So I'm a bit more active because I completely didn't go on Instagram for quite some time. And this is a trial and I'm waffling on, I know. If you do want to stick around, really appreciate it. If you left a like and subscribe to my channel, VJ202 on Insta if you want to. VJ202 on Vinted. Am I even speaking right? On Vinted. If um, you want to follow me on there, anything that don't fit, go straight on Vinted. I've got a ton of shit to list this week as well. So, yeah, I'll get on with it now because I do realise that I am waffling on. So, yeah. I am chuffed. All right, this one is a size extra small. This is from the Messiah Clothing Company. They're a very expensive one. All right. It's an extra small. Okay. If you are new to my channel, hi, my name's Faye and I squeeze into clothes that don't fit. All right, I'm size 18 to 20. I'm <laughs> just... Do you know what I mean? If I like something, I buy it. All right, but this is an extra small, okay? It's just a little bit tight, but I'm in. All right, I'm in. And I don't look stupid, I don't think. Like, some things I can absolutely stretch the shit out of. And you know I've stretched it out. It's not even got a pattern anymore because <laughs> it just looks like material. All right, so, yeah. Well, anyway, this one. I've tried to do it, like, so I'm a little bit more... Um, further back so you can see this is the dress can you see I feel really far away from my camera so I don't know if you can um, don't mind my messy kitchen it's kind of messy I've kind of tidied it but kind of not but um, like it's got big pockets here this was a quid all right online their dresses retail for £100 plus but this is the dress like it's not clinging I have got my top on underneath as well because it is white you're probably going to see my boobs, so I've left my top on because I haven't got a bra on. All right, we let the titties swing free on this channel, okay? Or I'm out of breath. Oh, give me a minute. Just give me a minute. Oh. What I'm in, I feel like it's not clingy, you know? It's not. Do you know what I mean? I've got the pockets and just feel nice. So, yeah, this is the first dress. I don't usually go for stripes this way because they do make me look, you know, wider than I am. But I really like this dress, so yeah, I feel I feel very pretty in it. Like if I just stand like that, that's how I would stand, and it doesn't cling. Like, do you know what I mean? <laughs> I like it. <sighs> Breathe. All right, this one's wiped the fucking life out of I me. Mean, let me tell you. So this is phase eight in a size fourteen. All right. Honestly, I'm fucked. I'm absolutely fucked. I'm not sure it's my style. It's took me forever to get on, I won't lie to you. Just the belt go at the back. Just the belt at the back, I don't know. But it's painful, this one. Oh, I'd just have it like that, I would. It's painful, okay? Now we're in, all right, it's not too bad. But, like, I can't see what I look like from far away, from far. <laughs> But um, I like it because you can't actually see your boobs, but it's a plunge. I never usually go for plunges because they just don't sit right. But, and I don't know if it's supposed to be short, long, long, short one. Do you know what I mean? It's really, is that how it's supposed to be? Or <laughs> is it full length on a size 14 on the arm? I don't know. My size 18 arms just ain't it. I don't know. Is it a bit too posh for me? I think it might be a bit posh, you know. I don't know. This is phase eight. They're a bit posher there. I don't know. And it's not like too... I prefer it a bit more slutty. I think it'd look better if it was a bit, you know, a bit up there. I feel like... I feel like one of them parents that's part of the PTA. Do you know? And then parents that really, really, really get involved and, you know, you get no end of emails about raffle tickets and, you know, being part of a governing parenting body. Is that what it is? I don't know. I'm one of them parents. I'm straight for my kid. Okay. Even if a teacher's coming towards me, I'm like, pretend you can't see them. And I'm just like, you know what, Mason? Go on. Do you know what I mean? And I'm just like, no. So, yeah, I, I feel like one of them. Don't judge me, will you? I might have fucked up here. We're all friends, all right? <laughs> I'm not sure what's going on. What was going through my head? This 
is a size 12. I fucked up. This is this is what I mean when I say sometimes I look like it looks like a face. The eyes. This is it. This ain't for me. This one ain't for me. I don't know what I was thinking. I have messed up, all right. But I hold myself accountable, okay? I know when I'm in the wrong. <sighs> what the fuck was I thinking? Okay, that's not what I might get away with it as a top. This is more me, all right. This is a pyjama top from Sainsbury's, it says Sleepyhead, you know? I love it, it's comfy, it's a size 16. <laughs> this is me, all right? I love comfy shit, so I'd wear this out, I would. <laughs> anyway, this is my size 16 loungewear top, so yeah, I'm absolutely in love. All right, this is a size 12, so it's like a peplum-y, like can you see here, it's got like the elasticated bit, I don't know if you can see my nipples, so. I'm just going to cover them, but this one I absolutely love, so it don't feel tight, like it's quite stretchy, you know, so this is from Asda, size 12, so this is where I mean like you're winning, you know, but um, yeah, I do like it, so yeah, as you can tell I am sweating my tits off, like my makeup is, I feel really hot and I'm going to cover my nipples for this one, but um, yeah, if I ever, all right, ever get an opportunity again in my life to go to an event, all right, this is what I'm wearing. Okay, this is the shirt that said linear. Is it linear? In a size large, all right. I just, I love this colour. I love this colour so much. So this is the shirt. Um, oh, my tits look all right there, don't they? <laughs> They're not too bad. But um, it's because I'm holding them up. But this is the shirt. And I, I just, I think it looks amazing. I'm really hot. It is so hot today, honestly. But I just love it, like, the little, like, that's cute. I know it's just, you know, how normal shirts go, but I think it looks a bit, a bit cute. I'm in love, honestly. This is my boob tube one that's got that, like, detail in here, which I really love. But I have noticed it's got a mark here, and I don't know if that's... It looks a bit bleacher, do you know what I mean? But it doesn't matter because what I'll do is I'll just wear it, you know, when I'm like going out with the kids up the beach, like it's perfect just to sit on the beach with. But I love it and I just loved that little bit of detail there, like it's different, you know? So yeah, just a plain black um, boob tube, you know, with a pair of jeans or, you know, I've got a pair of like plain black trousers on today, like flares, so. Yeah, I love it. I've got to be quick with this one because it hurts, but this is as far as it goes. I've literally just had to pull this over my boobs to show you the struggle, all right? But <laughs> this ain't the one. This is not happening, all right? This is a size, I don't know, I'll tell you in a minute, but whew, it's painful. Honestly, I, I'm going to end up walking it in a minute and just like, do you know what I mean? <laughs> it was nice. You know, it's a nice, pretty top. So yeah, my vintage is Fade J202, all right? I sell everything for the same price <sighs> that I've paid for it. You know, just if it don't fit, it's, you know, better on to someone else. So I will list all of these if I can get out. So another bargain, all right? I'm in love with this. Now I'm the old uh, fitness queen, okay? Bit of the old head for 50p. This was on the 50p rail, okay? Look at that. You just see me, can't you? Honestly, I can see myself doing a workout in this. This is nice, this is bargain, 50p. In all honesty, right, I didn't think I was gonna get in this at all, okay? And I was hoping I would. It has got a slight stain on it. I'm hoping to get out. A lot of people have said put a bit of fairy liquid on it. Is it there, can you see? But this was on the 50p rail as well, and I'm in love, like, I love red and it's just a really nice lightweight material and it was 50p like I love it so yeah chuff for this one as well but I just time fucking tits are swinging everywhere today this is honestly the material is so nice this is the Henry Holland one Henry Holland is it so yeah this is size 14 this was a quid but 
you can just picture it, can't you? With like some high-waisted jeans, my Clark's boots, like with the fur and stuff. Like, it's really nice. So, I'm really liking this one as well. But it's, yeah, I love it. So, um, yeah, it's a nice find this. I didn't even know, I didn't realise. So, yeah. I've got the biggest sweat on going after that try. <laughs> Honestly, my back's way through. Just manoeuvring, honestly. <laughs> but um, God, I'm sticky. Can you hear it? Can you hear the stick? So I'm gonna go and have a shower, nice cool one. But um, yeah, hope you enjoyed the try on. So a few hits, I was gonna say a few hitters and a few misses, but <laughs> a few hits and a few misses. So yeah, you know what I mean, you know what I'm trying to get at. I'm too hot and bothered. But um, yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video. I'd really appreciate it. Like I said, if you left a like and subscribe to my channel, if you're not already, it really means a lot. Um, and yeah, I am, uh, yeah, it worked out. I've got a furry tongue, you know, because I'm thirsty. I feel really, oh my God, I don't even like water really, but I know you have to drink it. Do you know what I mean? You have to force yourself to drink water. I do anyway. I can't stand it. It does hit the spot though. You know, especially in the heat, you've got to stay hydrated. But um. Yeah, tips from Fairly <sighs> to tell myself. But um, yeah, that's what I'm saying. If you do want to follow me on Instagram, it's fayj202 because, like I said, I'm going to do a little, little, little giveaway. I'll love you and leave you. As always, my friends, don't let any dickheads get you down. You are beautiful, okay? Absolutely beautiful. Can I just say, all right, wear what the fuck you want, okay? Honestly, seriously, wear what the fuck you want, all right? I know I have a bit of banter when we try on and stuff, but... Honestly, I wear what the fuck I want today. I've got a crop top on and I've got um, flares and I don't care. Like, I feel good. Do you know what I mean? Like, I don't care what anyone says. Like, oh, you shouldn't wear that crop top or your belly sticks out. I was on the beach the other day in a bikini, okay? I don't care, all right? Loads of other people were on the beach in a bikini, all right, of all shapes and sizes, okay? It means nothing, all right? And if anyone's stirring, if anyone's got something to say, that's their problem, okay? That is their problem, all right? Just... Don't acknowledge them, don't give a shit, alright? Seriously, be you, do you, for you, alright? That, that got me a jingle, that, ain't it? But, like, seriously, just honestly, we waste so much time, like, giving a shit about what people think. Do you know what I mean? It's really sad. It's really sad how much time we actually let other people live in our head. Do you know what I mean? Like, seriously, once you train your brain to get out of that and know your worth it's all about knowing your worth okay you're just as important just as valid just as worthy as every fucker else all right make your mark seriously do what you gotta do all right i love you all seriously wear what you want be who you want to be express yourself however the hell you want to express yourself because it's so important don't waste it all right don't waste it i know you sat there thinking how how do i start all this then do you know what i mean it's all talk shoes all right down a camera do you know what i mean chatting away chatting out our ass seriously it's really easy when you sat on the sofa thinking, oh, what if I can't do that? Do you know what I mean? Fuck, that's not for me. It's for someone else, but it's not for me. Honestly, it's for you. You, all right? It's for you, seriously. That person sat there that thinks, I can't look like that. I can't be like that. You, be you. Look like you. Do you, all right? You're amazing just as you are, okay? You're stunning, all right? Let that personality out. Let it just shine in every way, all right? I could go on forever, honestly. I really... Don't, honestly, don't give a shit, don't give a shit what people think, it's so important because it's really sad, it's really sad and with my Tyler you know I have to tell him because he's at that age where it's like preschool, not preschool, what I mean about not preschool, that was a long time ago, I mean um, pre-teen, is it that pre-teen pre stage where he's he is a little bit more conscious about what other people are saying, I've noticed a few little changes here and there and we all go through it, we've all been through it and I have to tell him you know you feel what you got to feel, do what you got to do, but ultimately, be you seriously. Don't let other people get in your head for anything, you know. And he had a rocky start to school. I'm going off now. He had a rocky start to school, and um, I think that knocked his confidence. And now I'm constantly trying to build that back up, you know, just telling him, like, honestly, fucking own it, all right? You're amazing, you're gorgeous, you're handsome, and you've got the whole world ahead of you, you know. And I say that to, for anyone. Okay, for anyone that needs to hear that, seriously, you've got, you've got the whole world, seriously, at any age, at any age, all right, fucking fly, any age, seriously, <sighs> age means nothing, it really does, you know, be you, 
that's all that counts. Authentically you, you know. I love you, I'm gonna go now. Cause I, honestly, I could be able to put kettle on if you want, sit and have, you know, more of a chat. But um, yeah, I love y'all, all right. Have a great weekend, won't you? And I'll see you in tomorrow's video.